student yesterday we have learned how to compute first okay today we will learn how to compute follow for the given non terminal so first what is the meaning of first we have already learned today we will learn what is follow and how to compute it so follow of a non terminal a is always a set of terminal that follows or occur to the right of an a for example if i write let's take an example if i write s gives me a small a b okay remember first and follow are always going to calculate for a non terminals only okay so who is going to follow a this small a isn't it so follow of capital a will be a small a getting it if i write s gives me let's say b c d so who is follower of this b it is c got the concept what is follow okay so now in order to compute a follow in a parser there are three rules okay so the first rule says let's go uh, learn this four rule okay so the first rule says if a is a starting alphabet okay means if a is a starting non terminal then you have to add dollar in its fall first rule okay means in our example this example e gives me t e bar i will always add dollar in it okay so according to first rule only for the स्टार्ट ऑफ द सिम्बॉल बी टी पी एस ग्रामर का जो है उसमें से जो ये एस है स्टार्ट ऑफ द सिम्बॉल और स्टार्ट ऑफ द नॉन टर्मिनल दैट फॉर दैट नॉन टर्मिनल यू हैव टू एड डॉलर इन इट्स फॉलो फर्स्ट रूल ओके सेकेंड रूल सीज इफ यू हैव अ प्रोडक्शन रूल ए गिवस यू और लेट से a gives you beta alpha or b alpha beta okay then follow of b will be always equal to alpha where alpha should be terminal agar alpha terminal hai you will directly add it in the follow of beta okay third rule says if you have a rule that a gives you b d and beta okay then as b is going to followed by d but d is not terminal and in follow we always want a set of terminals isn't it so follow of b in this case will always be first of d getting it means in order to compute follow you must know what is the first okay so remember third rule if follow of one non terminal is another non terminal then you have to find out first of that non terminal in our case follow of b is d where d is non terminal so find first of b and add it into a follow of b okay see follow of b will be equal to first of d and fourth rule says if a gives you b d okay and if you want to find out follow of d dekho yahan pe koi follow kar raha hai kya nahi in that case you have to consider follow of d will be equal to follow of a the formula says if a uh, d is a last non terminal then you have to always consider follow of d is equals to follow of its left hand side non terminal okay so follow of d will be equal to follow of e okay getting it now these are the four main rules but if we consider let's say a gives me b d okay and first of d is equal to absolute so now according to what i told you 
follow of b will be equal to follow of d but follow of sorry follow of b will be equal to first of d but first of d is epsilon so in this case b will be if we put the value of d as epsilon b will be your last element and if b is a last known terminal for the given production rule follow of b should always be equal to follow of a you have to remember it okay how will you consider it if b is a non terminal d is a non terminal then follow of b should have first of d in it but if first of d is epsilon the meaning of epsilon is null so if we put it as a null what you will get a gives you b where b is a last non terminal and if a given non terminal is last in a production rule according to rule number 4 then follow of that last non terminal should always equal to follow of the left hand side of your production rule that is a here so in our case here follow of b will be equal to follow of a okay i hope you understood all this four rule once you know all this four rule you can identify a follow of any non terminal easily so let's take our yesterday's problem now this is our yesterday's problem so as as per our first rule e is our start of the grammar so what we will do we will add dollar in it okay so e will have dollar in it now again obtained is there anywhere e yes e is here e is going to followed by whom closing bracket okay so we will write closing bracket okay now here t gives you or after t who is there e prime okay so follow of t is e prime but as e prime is what non terminal follow of t will be equal to or follow of t will add first of e prime in it okay got it according to our rule what i said follow of t should have first of e prime in it okay so first of e prime is what plus and epsilon so t mein kya aayega aapka plus now if it is an epsilon as i told you last if you put e bar as an epsilon then t will be the last element in a production rule if it is a last element then follow of t should include follow of e in it according to our rule so follow of e is what here dollar and closing bracket so we will add dollar and closing bracket in t okay now take the next one t is going to have e bar which we have already saw then f t dash okay so now f is going to followed by t prime but t prime is again a non terminal so follow of f will be equal to follow of f will be equal to first of t prime so check t prime ka first t prime ka first is star into dollar so follow of l will be having star in it okay then and dollar sorry epsilon now as it is an epsilon if we put epsilon here what will happen it will be a last element so t gives you f ho jayega in that case follow of f will include follow of t in it so follow of f is what now you have to find it out it will include follow of t in it follow of t kya hai plus closing bracket and dollar so it will be plus closing bracket and dollar got it now check for the t prime here so now as t prime is the last element follow of t prime will be equal to follow of t so follow of t is what plus 
dollar and closing bracket so follow up t prime will be what plus now e prime is remaining only now here e prime is the last element so e prime is last so it will include follow of e in it but what is follow of e it is dollar and closing bracket so we will write dollar and closing bracket so likewise we will obtain a first and follow for all the positions got it so i will repeat it okay see here in this case as e is your first element of or the start of the symbol so you will add follow me dollar okay then t e bar so t is going to followed by e prime or e dash follow of t will be equal to follow of e dash but follow of e dash as e dash is non-terminal follow of t will be equal to what first of e dash so first of e dash is what plus and dollar so t may apne plus add kia as it is sorry dollar t epsilon so as it is epsilon if you put it as an epsilon t will be last element as t is a last element follow of t will be equal to follow of e so follow of e kya hai dollar and closing bracket so we will add it in a t so it will be dollar and closing bracket similarly here e prime is a last element as e prime is last element it will have always have follow of e prime is equals to follow of e so follow of e prime kitna tha hamara humko find out karna hai follow of e was dollar and closing bracket so follow of e prime will be equal to what dollar and closing bracket likewise we have computed for others too okay so try to solve the problem which are given to you as a assignment and submit it as soon as possible thank you